All are in this cultural trance. Psychoanalysis has taught us that our intellect is a feeble thing, a tool of our instincts, and that we are all compelled to behave cleverly or stupidly by the commands of our emotional attitudes. is a consensus on the science. You mustn't have been listening to our testimony that we've had for the last few days with dozens of experts that have come in who have given completely different views. Well, there are So I would, I, would, I would encourage you to go back and look at the testimony there, this committee's heard. There are people who still believe that the moon landing was staged on a movie lot in Arizona. This guy's preaching, of course. We'll see that John Coleman, he won't debate anybody. The IPCC isn't even really a bunch of scientists, a bunch of UN globalists. Are you guys looking into this stuff? Are you, are you aware that he won't debate? Are you guys allowed to cover things like this or not? Would your bosses let you tell the real story about real Americans out here? Al Gore was in Chicago today to sign copies of his new book, Our Choice. There was a long line of supporters at the Borders Bookstore on State Street. Our Choice is a follow-up to Gore's Academy Award-winning documentary, An Inconvenient Truth. Gore has championed environmental issues for many years. His book is described as a call to action that answers many of the questions posed by the film. Gore was a co-recipient of the Nobel Peace Prize in 2007 for his work on climate change. Sir, can you comment on the uh, email, the documents that were uh, 
revealed a, a hack on the climate gate. Climate gate that says that the research is a fraud and it's all the Can you give a comment? Can you give me a comment, sir? It's fraud. No, 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 Eugenics operation. Don't touch me. This is a eugenics operation. This guy's not around. What they're trying to sue Al Gore. Look it up. This is a eugenics program. This is New World Order. He is lying to all of us. He's lying to us before. Wake up, people. Wake up. Wake up. This is a New World Order. Can I give you that, Mr. Gore? It's just science that shows that 31,000 scientists are speaking out against your eugenics okay, club you. of Rome right agenda, here. sir. Thank the you. new world order will fail, and we realize that this is against our sovereignty. I have a First Amendment right. You do not need to assault me, sir. I am leaving. I am leaving. You do not need to assault me, sir. I have a First Amendment right. Yeah. This man wants to create a centralized global government. 31,000 scientists. That man is, this is Nazi fascism. Any comments on climate gate? The emails that prove it's a scam, it's a farce, oh, global know. warming Thank is a joke. You. Any Thank comment? You. Comment you. on climate gate? Climate gate? First Amendment rights here. Climate gate! Climate gate! Research climate gate! This guy's a fraud! It's a scam! They are trying to institute a global government through a carbon tax! This guy's working on a carbon tax! That's all it is! It's global government! There are 30,000 scientists trying to sue this guy. John Coleman, the founder of the Weather Channel, is suing this bum. You're all in line for this bum. It's a global government. Get your hands off me. First Amendment rights, get your hands off me. Let's talk about carbon polluters. You talk about them. It's my understanding that back in 1997, when you were vice president, Enron's CEO, Ken Lay, was involved in discussions with you at the White House about helping develop this type of policy, this trading scheme. And uh, is, that, is that accurate? Is it inaccurate? It's, it's been reported. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Woo! Thank you, Al. Happy Thanksgiving. Hey, Al. All right. Can you guys stay back over Thank here, you. please? I'm Al Gore, comedy star. Global warming. <laughs> <laughs> it's unbelievable. I'm Al Gore. <laughs> I'm Al Gore. 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 I